Passengers on board the Carnival Elation given life jackets after the ship lost power. Right now, the parking lot at Jacksport is packed. That's because passengers for the Elation's next trip are arriving. They're being told to come back later. Ship lost power for a short time, shortly before 2 this morning. Channel 4's Heather Lee has been speaking with passengers who were on board. Joins us live with an update. Heather. So, Bruce, you brought up traffic, and that really is the big issue right now because here's, here's the problem. All of these uh, passengers that were on this ship uh, were delayed. They were out there, what I'm being told, about an hour later than typical. So when they got back here, they got back here rather late, and therefore they were getting off the ship late. So all of the people that are arriving right now, and I'll kind of point your direction over here. You can see that this is all the traffic. These are all the people that are arriving to try and get on board and get their parking spot, get here early. Um, for a while, we're being told to turn around and come back later, but now it seems as if they're letting them in slowly but surely. You can see there's officers over here directing traffic, and uh, they're getting people that were on that cruise ship out and letting people in. But again, it's a very slow process. So what you heard uh, from Carnival Cruise Line is that there was a short power outage. Um, what I'm being told by a woman who was on the ship, it was about 45 minutes that they were at a standstill out at sea. And uh, she says that it happened around 1.45 a.m. She woke up and she saw that the power was out um, near uh, in the hallways and then it kept flickering back on and off. So she says everyone sort of kind of went up to the decks. She says a lot of people started grabbing their life jackets just in case, at, kind of out of fear. And when they got up there, people uh, with Carnival crews were saying, go back to your room everything's fine and then that's when they got on and uh, gave an update saying that everything was okay but of course that woman I spoke with says it was a very scary situation I would like to know um, what's going on just like everybody else wanted to know we kind of like were asking each other what's going on did you hear anything was we didn't know and then the captain didn't seem very confident when he did come on the air so again, uh, like you heard, they are slowly but surely letting people into the parking lot here. Um, what I was told by police officers is if you can wait till after 1.30 to get here, it might help with these traffic problems and then you're not stuck in this traffic. And I also want to say that Carnival Cruise Line says that this problem has been fixed and they did not cancel any cruises uh, at this point anyway. So it looks like this next cruise is set to leave at 5 o'clock. It's uh, going to leave at that time. And again, if you can arrive a little bit later, maybe right after 1.30, you won't be stuck in all this traffic. Uh, for now, we're live. Heather Lee, Channel 4, the local station.